Hey everyone and welcome to another video and we have another collaboration with Model Ones and we're going to create this nail design so let's get right into it. So I received a 32 piece gel polish set and they are beautiful colors, very spring, summer vibes so you can use it for both um, spring and summer and I'm going to be creating like a spring nail design with this but you know let's go over everything that's in this box so on the back it has the ingredients direction storage and warnings and their contact information they are on facebook tiktok youtube instagram everywhere and this box is everything it's very sturdy it's it's really good so we're gonna go ahead and open it and see what's in there so of course, it's just a regular box and it comes with a pamphlet which tells you how to prep for your nail, do the application, and also how to remove as well. And there's also information on the back that tells you, you know, just a little Q&A if you have any questions about anything and some warning storage and contact information again. So I'm going to zoom through taking everything out the box and then putting them in order. And guess what guys? All the colors are in chronological order. Oh my god. Amazing. Like the more I use model one, the more I love them. And it does come with two top coats, a base coat and a matte coat. So that's everything. And I'm going to go ahead and swatch them on my little plate. This is a tile that I got from Home Depot. You can get one too from Lowe's or any home goods store. And we're just going to swatch them. These are 7 ounce bottles. So I didn't really want to do a full swatch and a swatch stick. Um, so I can save my ounces. <laughs> but there's so many in there that you'll be set for basically the whole summer doing your nails 32 colors yes you'll be set so i'm going through them one by one and then we're going to take a closer look so i'm just going to let you guys watch this And here are all the colors. They are gorgeous, especially for the summer and the springtime. These are just perfect. 
and I chose four colors that we're going to use because I am using my practice hand from Vita Bella and we're going to put some base coat from Model 1's as well before we start and we're going to cure for 60 seconds and then I'm going to put my colors on and do my design. Just an FYI, I did do two coats of gel polish on each finger and I cured both time for 60 seconds. So for this nail design, I am using the same colors and I'm going to be creating some flowers, which I had some difficulty with, but um, it came out really well in the end. I was doubting myself, but you know what? It's always good to push through and see the final look before you say, no, 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 no. <laughs> but before I start, I put some matte top coat on. It's when you're doing nail art, it is recommended, highly suggested that you put some matte coat first, cure for 60 seconds before you start your nail design. Now, if you're drawing a picture or something, I definitely recommend using matte first. And I did cure for 60 seconds, as I said, and we are gonna get right into the design.
Before I draw my vines, I'm cleaning the nails off to remove the tacky layer. I have to say that as simple as this nail design looks, it is not as easy to do. <laughs> You know, and I know like a lot of nail techs who takes clients, um, a lot of their clients are like, oh, this should be easy for you to, you can knock this out in five seconds, but this is not the case. Um, even when you've, I'm sure you've heard a lot of nail tech talk about doing French, French nail designs, like, no, it's not that easy. Like, yes, we master it after a while but it's still not an easy design to do and i hope you guys enjoyed watching me do this um i did take out a lot of my bloopers <laughs> but um yeah so let's go on and now i'm making like a vine to go through the nails and i am going to cover it with some gold chrome powder so Stay tuned for that. So we have come to the end of my video and I hope you guys enjoyed this nail design. I hope you, you've seen that my flowers were not perfect but in the end it looks really good. Like I am happy with everything like I was like doing these little petals and I'm like man these look really janky. I think I might need to redo them but i'm like you know what i'm just gonna leave them alone because i have this idea of what i'm doing and look at this beautiful thank you guys for watching don't forget to like share and subscribe and i will see you guys in the next video